Hey, what is up everybody? It is Wick here and I'm going to be talking about this Rolo wireless printer that I bought. I'm going to tell you my thoughts on it, do a little bit of a review video on it because I got some questions. I did a video well, about four years ago now on the original Rolo printer. I started seeing some comments on that recently about, hey, how's the wireless one? Have you tried the wireless one? And I'm thinking, Rolo made a wireless printer. Let me head on over to Amazon and take a look. And sure enough, there is a new version of the Rolo printer. And since I did a lot of information on the original one, I figured, yeah, I'll go ahead and purchase this and give it a shot and uh, do a video on it. Now, I'm not sponsored by Rolo and they did not send me this. This was purchased with my own money, just like the original Rolo printer. And for the original video, I have a ton of information that is relevant to this one because they have pretty much the same specs except for this one is wireless. This one also is $100 more. Now, I don't know if the $100 price increase warrants the wireless capabilities, I don't know what it cost as in a manufacturing sense to do that. It seems like it shouldn't be $100 more just for wireless. However, I don't know. Now for me, I don't necessarily need wireless. I have it set up upstairs in my shipping room connected to the laptop, even though my laptop actually is terrible. But it is useful for me if I'm downstairs doing an Amazon shipment and I need to print something from down here upstairs. Uh, otherwise, I have to save it as a PDF, send it to that computer, then print that way, which is kind of cumbersome. I also seem to have like internet maintenance a lot in the morning when I'm up doing my morning shipping. And sometimes my internet's just down for, you know, just a few minutes or enough to inconvenience me. So it's nice to be able to print off your phone, even though again, I can just hook up my hotspot to my laptop and use it that way with my phone. So I don't necessarily need the wireless printer, but I know a lot of people just use their phone to do all their printing off of eBay, Macari, Poshmark, wherever they're selling. But what I'm gonna say about the Rolo printer I've used the last four years or so is that I've not had any issues with it. When I say no issues, I mean zero issues, no print errors, no paper jams, anything like that. It's just worked flawlessly every single time. And that kind of blows my mind because anyone who's printed, like I print for last couple decades, right? And you just always have paper jams or some sort of problem. Before I bought that Rolo printer, I had the Dymo 450 XL, uh, which I know a lot of people like. Uh, that's their printer of choice. But for me, there's just problem after problem right out of the box. Also, I was buying off-brand labels to save money and a lot of off-brand labels don't work very well with the Dymo printers because Dymo sets them up to work with uh, their name brand labels, which costs more. So I ended up getting rid of that, <laughs> that Dymo printer, decided to just get the Rolo printer, uh, pay the extra money, which actually I think the Dymos are more than the Rolos now, right? They're very close in price anyway, and I've been a big fan of the Rolo since. It's just a high quality printer and good reliability. Well, what about the Rolo wireless printer? Now, I got this and it sat for a couple of days. I had to motivate myself to open it up and set it up because in my mind, it's like, oh, I'm gonna have to troubleshoot the issues to set it up. Uh, it's probably gonna take like a full day. You know how it is when you get like new electronics or something like that, it just seems be always a problem. Well, I plugged this in when I finally opened it and there's an app you download. I downloaded the app and then it just, from there, you just connect it to your uh, wireless internet, your router, and then you're done. It just, it's worked perfectly. Uh, there was no problems with it. Like I've got those smart bulbs and stuff before and it, it could take like an hour to get those things working sometimes. After it connected, I was able to hit the a test button and it test printed a label and it worked flawlessly. You can also, from the app, if you want to, you can sign up and use the Rolo shipping service, which is definitely not a requirement. Uh, they claim to give like big shipping discounts and all kinds of you know, claims. I've never used it, so I don't know how good it is. I get a pretty good discount just shipping off of eBay directly. I don't know if Rolos would be better. If anyone has used the Rolo shipping service, just leave some information in the comments for everybody watching. Uh, that would be great. But while I was looking at that, it just randomly printed a label. And I'm like, oh no, why did it just print a label? But when I looked at the label, it was just let me know that it was updated. Uh, updated the firmware and I thought, yeah, that's cool. Then I thought, wait a minute, I didn't give you permission to waste one of my labels. So that was kind of weird. I know a lot of people don't like 
their electronics being connected to the internet and updating and stuff like that, the, the firmware, but trust me, it's a good thing. As Wi-Fi technology is changing and, and getting better every year, you need to be able to update things like this so if they work. Just means they'll you know, last 10 or 20 years compared to like five years or something like that once technology changes a bit. So after it was set up, I, I had some eBay sales. So I'm like, hey, let's, let's test it out. Went to my phone and printed a label from there. All I had to do was just pick the printer I wanna use, and of course it was already showing the Rolo, and just printed it, worked perfectly. As to be expected, I was able to print stuff downstairs uh, from up to upstairs off the computer. Rolo claims that it works with uh, like Macari, Amazon, Shopify, Poshmark, Etsy, all the big names. And I'm not, I haven't tested it with every service because I don't sell it with every service, uh, but I would expect it to work. And if you didn't check out the original Rolo video, again, check that out because uh, there's a lot of information in that video that applies to this one, like their customer service. Uh, I didn't have a customer service issue, but I, I sent one, I sent a ticket just to test to see how well they responded to it. And they did a great job within 24 hours, answered my question and explained stuff. Their website set up to be very easy to find out information. So for me personally, I haven't decided if this is a good purchase for me. Obviously it's an extremely high quality printer. Everything works flawlessly, but I already got a Rolo printer that's been working flawlessly for four years now. And I don't necessarily need to get this one and pay $300 for to just get the wireless capabilities. Now I did check eBay and since I'm a, a reseller, I'm able to sell my old Rolo printer. I can sell it on eBay for about $175. So I can get almost all my money back that I originally paid for it. So doing that, I probably will just keep this. Like, why not? It's just an upgrade. But if you are new and this is your first thermal printer or you've been using the Dymo or one of the uh, Chinese uh, thermal printers that you find on a line on Amazon and you've been having problems with it then I definitely suggest either getting the original Rolo or this one. My viewers are asking me all the time which printer I use, which photo box, and uh, I always recommend the Rolo printer. You can let me know in the comments if you think the extra hundred dollars is worth it for wireless and there's definitely ways to set up printers wirelessly through network servers and stuff like that it just takes a little bit more computer knowledge i also have links in the description for uh the original rollo and this one at the time of this video there was a i think a 20 dollar off coupon or something like that going on on amazon so i'll have that linked uh, maybe if you're quick enough uh, when the video comes out, I'll still be going on, but you know, don't count on that. But there it is. I just wanted to make an update video for the new wireless Rolo printer. Uh, since I got so much attention on my other Rolo video in the past. If you found this video helpful, just hit that like button on the way out. You can find me on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, flipping underscore junk. And this has been Wick. Till next time.